Hello, if you've just now signed up for Convey, I'm going to do a high-level walkthrough of some of the features you will see in this admin console. First, if I click Create App, Convey is going to spin up a full instance of a backend. You can see that it's already created a development environment for me to work in. I can also clone this development environment as part of a standard software development lifecycle to create a test environment, pilot environment, and ultimately production. I can also migrate content like users or data between environments for testing. If you follow along with our Getting Started Guides in the Dev Center, one of the first things that we'll have you do is initialize the app to the back end. To do so, you'll need your app key and app secret, which can be found here. You can find more information about getting started in our Dev Center, including reference guides, tutorials, code samples, and API references. You can download any of our client libraries from here, complete with a fully transparent timeline. Okay, let's talk about users and user management. First off, Convey has its own built-in OAuth2 user store. This can be for consumer applications or applications where you don't have the user's identity stored in some enterprise identity provider. I can quickly spin up a new user, and you can see that we offer a lot of the user management features out of the box. We also allow you to hook into any enterprise identity provider through Mobile Identity Connect. We support a broad range of protocols, including LDAP, Active Directory, several different flavors of SAML, OAuth2, OpenID Connect, and Custom. Next, we have our data collections. I can instantly spin up an instance of a NoSQL data store optimized for mobile. When I do so, I can import data, export data, and change permissions. Front-end developers can work with these data collections to quickly and easily begin prototyping their application. And when the backend system of record is available, Convey can make that change without changing any code on the client. These collections can persist in Convey's data store or come from an external system of record. In either case, accessing or querying the collection is always done in a single consistent manner. Now let's look at our file store. You can either drag and drop files here or you can use our client libraries to upload content. You can store any type of file and any associated metadata that you'd like. Convey libraries let you either download a copy to the client or stream the content if it's something like video. The API console is a testing tool, similar to something like a Postman, where the front-end developer can see exactly what response he or she can expect back from Convey. Our business logic lets you perform all kinds of data manipulation on data passing through the Convey backend. You can aggregate data, filter data, engage users with push notifications, email or SMS, log events, and many other things. These can be hooks that intercept requests coming from the client and the responses going back to the client. These can also be standalone services or ones that are hooked up to our scheduler for performing periodic manipulations of the data. We make push really easy. You just upload your P12 certificate for iOS and your sender ID and API key for Android, and our client libraries take care of the rest in terms of registering and unregistering the device for push and receiving the push notification. Under environment settings, you can add any number of collaborators to this environment. We do also have a separate service catalog where backend developers can come and configure no-code and low-code integrations to your enterprise systems of record. These services in the service catalog can be shared across apps in a controlled fashion, and backend developers have complete control over which operations they allow within any given service. Now you're ready to start making your app ideas a reality.